I was fortunate enough to play against a lot of great cricketers during my career, but the greatest I played against was Brian Lara. Well, Brian Lara was phenomenal. He, as a left-hander, I just stood and admired his ability to, to play shots anywhere around the ground against any opponent. And again. The hallmark of a genius. There's no doubt about it. On his day, he could just uh, well, he'd take you apart and he could do what he wanted. One series in early 2000 when he toured Sri Lanka, he took Muli apart. He scored 700 runs against us in a three-match series. We dominated the series, we won the series, but we just couldn't get Brian out. He was just on a mission. I had to watch Brian Lara score 613 or some ridiculous amount of runs on his own. I bowled against him when he got 375 and from about 120 it just seemed inevitable but I think the bigger feat was getting 400 because if you go somewhere once, the second time you try and go there you try and do it a bit quicker, cut some corners and make mistakes but he didn't. He's probably played half a dozen of the best 20 innings that have ever been played. Lara gives himself room here quite beautifully and wonderful timing gets him four. Just shifted his weight back and inside the line of the ball. Great shot. In the 1990s, uh, Brian Lara, Sachin Tendulkar, Ricky Ponting, Jack Callis, these guys were all at the top of the tree. But I just feel that Brian Lara was just above them all, really. He was flamboyant, he was beautiful to watch, and one of the greats of the game in all time that high back lift, those elegant strokes that he could play, kind of Calypso-Caribbean style of one knee above his chest somewhere and whipping the ball into the leg side. A lot of children are told never to have, you know, a high back lift, but you look at Brian, those beautiful, flourishing, high back lift that brings the bat down so quickly and exactly at the right time on that ball. And there it is, Brian Lara puts his signature immediately on the 2003 World Cup. And not only West Indians in the crowd, but everyone around this Newland Stadium standing to a man and uh, appreciating what has been a tremendous innings, a vital innings for the West Indies from a tremendous batsman. Those battles we had out in the middle is something I'll always remember and you know, he was just a quality batsman. You know, I've never seen uh, a batsman uh, that good really. To break the world record for the highest test score once, you know, is enough. Uh, but to do it twice really just shows you uh, how much Brian Lara was a class above uh, every other player.